the topic of the session is on radicals radical form of mathematics is n root of a a is always a positive value and n we call it as an index value how it came it came from exponent form a to the power of 1 by n can be written as n to root of a radicals we can other way to pronounce it as surge form now how to convert or how to rewrite uh, uh, radical forms to exponent form uh, square root of 2 is nothing but 2 to the power of 1 by 2 cube root of 5 is nothing but 5 to the power of 1 by 3 before solving a set of problems if you are thorough with the basic square root values and become easy for you to work it out for example root 4 is nothing but 2 root of 81 is 9 square root of 625 is 25 formula to be remember a product rule of a radical is nth root of a times nth root of b is nth root of a times b quotient rule nth root of a divided by b can be written as nth root of a divided by nth root of b and index rule is knth root of a to the power of km is nothing but nth root of a power m the index in index k common factor we can scratch it so it become nth root of a power m and points to be remembered uh, four basic operations are necessary for solving all problems under this topic addition of two radical numbers root of a plus root of a is nothing but two times of root of a for example the square root of 3 plus square root of 3 is nothing but 2 times square root of 3 subtraction square root of a minus square root of b is nothing but 0 well known result for example root 5 minus root 5 is 0 multiplication very important rule remember root a square root of a times square root of a and the same such forms is nothing but a okay for example square root of 7 times square root of 7 is 7 come to division root a divide root a as similar radical forms is always 1 while dividing root 2 divide by root 2 which is equal to 1 is a good example for division operation now a basic type of questions from this topic is always change a radical into a radical form into exponent form or exponent form into uh, radical forms 3 times 8 to the power of 3 by 5 exponent form how to convert it into a radical form is 3 times uh, fifth root of a power 3 fifth root of a to the power of 3 if this is given uh, they may ask convert into exponent form we can rewrite as 3 times a to the power of 3 by 5 the 5 the denominator form we call it as an index value of this uh, square root or radical form sorry now come to 7x whole to the power of 2 by 3 is nothing but cube root of 7x whole power 2 or we can rewrite as cube root of 49 x power 2 7 squared is 49 x to the power of 2 you can simplify further and rewrite also that is also agree or you can stop with this also now a second type of questions from this topic is simplify simplify the addition work division work subtraction or multiplication works so see these two uh, fraction form fraction with the radical forms are given how to simplify this square root of 75 divided by 4 plus square root of 3 divided by 16 I convert I by applying a quotient rule for the first term square root of 75 can be written as 3 times 25 divide by square root of 4 plus again I am applying quotient rule for the second term of the question root 3 divided by root 16 now square root of 25 is nothing but 5 and root 3 you keep it as it is denominator value square root of 4 is 2 and uh, plus come to the second term root 3 I give it as it is square root of 16 is 4 now simplifying this two fraction with two different uh, denominator we need to take a LCM least common multiples of this two fraction as 4 for 2 and 4 
and multiply 2 with the numerator for the first fraction it become 2 times 5 root 3 plus 1 times square root of 3 for the second now simplify the numerator 2 times 5 is 10 root 3 plus square root of 1 times root 3 whole divide by a denominator is as it is 4 now 10 root 3 plus 1 times root 3 become 11 root 3 divided by 4 is the solution of this simplification now check it with other form other type of problem multiply and simplify now uh, radical terms are present in the factors so example uh, root x minus 2 times root x plus 4 multiply and simplify so start with multiplying with root x term with these two terms in the second fact root x into root x i return root x times root x plus root x into 4 is 4 times root x now start with second term of the first factor multiply with uh, the, the two terms in the second factor negative 2 times root x is negative 2 times root x negative 2 times positive 4 become negative 2 times positive 4 i return now simplify root x times root x is nothing but x 4 root x minus 2 times root x subtraction i am applying here it become 2 times root x minus uh, 2 times 4 is 8 and this is the final solution you can't simplify furthermore now rationalize the denominator another uh, challenging problem under this topic okay always a fraction form is given in the denominator rational numbers are given the question is rationalize the denominator one good example is enough you can solve all the problem the concept of this is same you can apply for the different type of questions now my question is root 8 minus root 5 all divided by root 8 plus root 5 see the denominator rational numbers on them how to rationalize the denominator step number one multiply and divide by the conjugate of the denominator root 8 plus 5 plus root 5 is a denominator form what is a conjugate root 8 minus root 5 divided by root 8 minus root 5 now as the uh, remaining discussions are very similar to the previous type of problems multiply the numerator multiply the factors of the denominator now i'm multiplying the numerator factor root 8 times root 8 um, root 8 times minus root 5 see minus root 8 times root 5 now negative root 5 times root 8 negative root 5 times root 8 negative into negative positive root 5 times root 5 i return as positive root 5 times root 5 divide by denominator a plus b times a minus b it become a square minus b square algebraic expansion i'm applying here so a here is root 8 and b here is root 5 see root 8 to the power of 2 minus root 5 whole to the power of 2 now come to the simplification root 8 times root 8 is 8 minus root 8 times root 5 minus root 5 times root 8 this is nothing but root 40 this is root 40 so i can simplify minus root 40 minus root 40 become minus 2 times of square root of 40 plus root 5 into root 5 is nothing but 5 come to the denominator square root square get cancelled 8 minus square root square get cancelled it become 5 8 minus 5 is the denominator term now 8 plus 5 at the numerator uh, real values 30 minus 2 times uh, square root of 40 i can rewrite as 4 times 10 i did what is square root of 4 2 so i can multiply i can take out of the radical form 2 as 2 times 2 become 4 so 13 minus 4 root 10 divide by 3 is the solution of this problem now solving uh, uh, radical equations how to solve the radical equations solve for x the term contained in radical form so root of x plus 4 minus root of x minus 4 which is equal to 2 is my a good example and a challenging problem also so first step squaring on both sides see left hand side we have two terms so square it together squaring on both sides is a concept i square it left hand side terms together whole power 2 which is equal to right hand side 2 only 2 to the power of 2 that is nothing but 4 we can rewrite now for the left hand side i am applying a minus b to the power of 2 form a square minus 2ab plus b square see i am applying square root of x plus 4 whole power 2 minus 2 times square root of x plus 4 times root of x minus 4 plus root of b square is nothing but square root of x minus 4 
to the power of 2 which is equal to 4 2 square is 4 I already told okay now square root square get cancelled it become x plus 4 minus 2 times root of x plus 4 into root of x minus 4 is nothing but root of x square minus 4 square I apply here a square minus b square formula and square root uh, square get cancelled for the third term of left hand side it become x minus 4 which is equal to right hand side is 4 now how to simplify x plus x is 2x and positive 4 negative 4 we can scratch it so positive 4 negative 5 scratch it it becomes 0 x plus x is 2x okay and uh, minus 2 times square root of x square minus 16 remains as it is in the left hand side which is equal to 4 to the right hand side now I bring this 4 to the left hand side as negative 4 and negative radical term to right hand side as 2 times square root of x square minus 16 uh, positive form. Now once again square uh, still we have the square root term in this equation. So how to eliminate that one? Squaring on both sides I did once again. So 2x minus 4 whole power 2 which is equal to 2 times square root of x square minus 16 whole to the power of 2. So remember you have to square completely left side as well as right side for this form in this equation. Now using once again using a minus b to the power of 2 I expand left hand side as 4x square minus 2ab is uh, 2 times 2 4 4 times 4 16 negative 16 times x plus b power 2 is 4 square is positive 16 which is equal to 2 square is 4 and square root square get cancelled it become x square minus 16. How to simplify now? 4x square minus 16x plus 16 is left hand side and to the right I multiply 4 inside the bracket 4x power 2 minus 16 times 4 is 64. Now 4x square 4 x power 2 appears both left as well as right hand side we can scratch it, it become uh, 0 negative 16x which is equal to I bring this positive 16 to the right side it become negative 16 negative 64 negative 16 is nothing but negative 80 so minus 16 times x which is equal to negative 80 so x become negative 80 divided by negative 16 this is nothing but positive 5 so hope you understand this explanation please if you have any queries uh, drop your comments in my comment box or any other difficult or challenging problem please uh, share it to my email id i will solve it and re revert to you thank you thank you very much